So when uh, Fairfield Susun Unified School District uh, contacted us to work on their new project at the school, uh, we were very excited because uh, Public Safety Academy has this special program um, that trains students to be first responders. So it was a very intriguing program for us. The design process was very inclusive and collaborative. It actually began when we developed our facilities master plan just as I was coming on board as principal of the Public Safety Academy. And throughout the entire process, we as a staff has been involved, um, our parents, our students, um, just everyone in the community, our neighbors have been able to give input. So it really has been a collaborative process. What I loved about our architects is that we would throw out these great ideas and they would say, yeah, that's doable. I think we could do that. I think we could. And so, um, as you can see, they turned out even better than we ever anticipated. So we had sessions where everybody had a say. We even did um, hands-on exercises where people, we were moving pieces around to see how the spaces would work. Uh, we explained to them the importance of natural light and how we wanted to orient the building so we could maximize that natural light without having to force everything with uh, mechanical equipment. So one of the great things about the design was that we had virtual reality and so we got to experience and see what the building was going to look like. But it did give us the ability to have conversations about color and furniture and where we might place things because we did make a lot of changes um, based on what we saw in the virtual reality. I would say the things that uh, impressed me the most was how open the buildings are. I think that's super nice. It flows nice in my opinion. Um, I really like our new gym. There's a lot of space in there to do things, yeah. The upper science buildings that are right up there uh, because of just the light and how it's so open and large and the walls you can write on them and I would definitely advocate to have that space. I think it's amazing to have the natural light in here, the very open space to come hang out with your friends. It's very relaxing. The construction process during the school year was very exciting and it brought up a lot of curiosity with the staff, myself, the students. We would be out at PE or formation and we would watch um, them pouring concrete. We would watch with the scissor lifts and it was very fascinating to see all of the workers and the skill and talent that it took to build such a phenomenal building. I think that's a big draw for our, our students. They love to come in. I was just telling a parent that during the first three or four weeks that the library was opened, we could not fit any more bodies in than what were in here before school, after school, during lunchtime. And the open feel of it was a big draw for our kids. And to be able to look out at our beautiful fields and our play structure, um, and also I think it's better for them because they get the natural light. And it was better than we could have ever expected. It was very re rewarding to see today the users come in and see the space for the first time. Uh, again, uh, understanding how it's gonna uh, motivate students to, to learn in these spaces.